Santa. That's what oh, I want. Did you know Santa's visiting tomorrow? Oh, is he really? Santa Claus, baby. You can't beat it. <laughs> Does it bring you a present? I, geez, I hope so. <laughs> so, well, uh, what was your answer? Well, the announcement, actually, I did ask for one thing, and I'm hoping that I made that first this morning is in my driveway. I'm looking for oh. a new car. You <laughs> can't beat that, can you? No. So, what do you think the chances are that Santa's bringing me a new car by Christmas morning? Actually, no, I, I think this time I'm shooting for oh a Mercedes or a BMW SUV. I just hope that Santa, that big bad boy that he is, brings me my car! I want a new car! <laughs> Good for you, I hope you're getting it. Tell us what you asked for for Christmas. Love. Love. Sorry about that. Get along, okay. right? Uh, together. I, I agree with that. Tell us this. How do you feel about Santa Claus? Do you believe in Santa Claus? I do. You don't? Well, I do too. What about all the good boys and girls that are out there? And they come and they say, Do you believe in Santa Claus? And you say, Do you? <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess you believe in Santa Claus. I do. It's a good thing. I know this. Santa Claus is busy on the show. Tomorrow. Mayhem and Mansfield 2, December 19th, Saturday night. George Papazidis is fighting Artie Mullen in the cage. Anything can happen. You don't know. Anything can happen. Absolutely. And you know what you want. What? Tell us. You have not given me an example. What can we expect from you tomorrow? Well, I can't even say that because uh, you don't know how things are, you know? Certain situations are going to be different things, but I'll tell you one thing. I won't back down from anybody. And you know that. You're not afraid of anybody. You take on anybody. You don't fear anybody. I'll fight anybody. And you'll fight anybody! Does he have a new nickname? You have a new nickname? It's the gods on the street. Does George, you have a new nickname, George? G Force, right here. G Force. G Force, baby. Where do you get the nickname? One of my friends. I like the girls. Let's take one question from the audience. Take a question from the audience. 
How are you going to end the fight, George? George, how are you going to end the fight? We're going to knock the guy out. How do you think? How? Just TKO, KO, how? TKO, baby. That fist? Right here. Better than ever, right here. Let's take one more question from the audience. Sure, Dave, go ahead. <laughs> go ahead, Dave. <laughs> What have you been, been practicing? What have you been practicing? I've been practicing a lot of kicking, uh, uh, you know, stretching and stuff, uh, punching, everything, you know, a little bit of everything. Hey, listen, I work off hard, and I would just say that to make it seem like I, I put the time in, you know. I'm uh, 47 years old, these guys are half my age. It doesn't matter. I know what I do. Artie's not half your age. Yeah. I don't. Can you give me an age on Artie Mullen, please? He's right behind you, I think. I think Artie might be like 40 years old. Oh, that's good. About my age, huh? 42. 42. Artie is 42. 42. Gotta love the guys that are over 40, huh? <laughs> Still kicking ass, huh? That's right. Absolutely. Yeah, listen, I respect everybody. I want to be And I uh, really need this. Uh, once it's time to walk down that aisle, the mood has to change.